Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. Take it from the top. I mean, we, so, like, we were always, we, we had the joke of calling it the title update, since title update, anyway. The in, in, industry insider joke. Hmm. Um, so uh, when you come back in from the update, if you are in World Tier 4, you will see a new mission in which plot happens. And uh, this new mission will say, oh, here is your reason and excuse for being able to finally go and, and strike Tidal Basin. It's a stronghold, right? Which is a stronghold. Okay. Which, as per the, the, the rhythm of the rest of Endgame, is that that means that once you've defeated that Tidal Basin mission, uh, you will be promoted to World Tier 5. And now the gear score bracket is between 450 and 500. And sort of a, a small slew of new build opportunities become available to you because you're going to, when you defeat the boss there, encounter your first set of gear set items. Mm. Um, there are three gear sets coming out uh, with the Tidal Basin update. Mm -hmm. uh, some people have already seen information about True Patriot. Yeah. Yep. There's another one called uh, Ongoing Directive and another one called Hardwired. And cool. they're all a blast and have very long description te text because... We're crazy people. Mm. Uh, <laughs> For all you uh, Excel spreadsheet fans. Yes. yes. Yeah, welcome to yet that one, layer. Yeah, well, welcome to that one <laughs> cell that is just real big mm -hmm. in that spreadsheet. Uh, <laughs> and they're, they're all a blast. Uh, you acquire them by, like, uh, they can drop from, uh, from Black Tusk enemies. Uh, you can, they will drop from Invaded Missions because uh, when even more plot happens inside of World Tier 5, uh, suddenly invasions can happen again, and another stronghold can become invaded along with uh, other missions, and those missions can include missions that are not part of the current in-game campaign. Cool. Uh, so you can be like, oh, and I don't know this will be true for the first week, but like Jefferson Plaza, for example, mm -hmm. or, uh, or the Lincoln Memorial, all of those ones can, uh, yeah. can become invaded and... Just genuinely, some of them contain the nastiest boss fights that we could think of. It's a delight. Awesome. Uh, and invaded missions uh, will have selectable difficulty in World Tier 5, including a new difficulty that you've never seen before called Heroic, uh, which is just... Is that, that's kind of in line, you mentioned before, with uh, the control points at the fourth reinforcement. Yeah, so at the, at the fourth mm -hmm. tier of, uh, of a control point, they are currently running a Heroic difficulty. Okay. If any of you have gotten to the center of the week's priority target network, you've also encountered heroic difficulty before. But now, imagine if you basically didn't have checkpoints anymore inside of missions. Hmm. So I actually do, there was an image, it may already be online, I think. If not, we're going to show, show you here it's this, this image. I got it from, from a team upstairs. Yep. Because, Yannick, you'll be able to talk a little bit about this. It's, uh, can we just have a look at this one? Yes. I was like, I don't the know what you're about yeah. to show, so, <laughs> so sure, so surprise me. So April 5th, the Invasion uh, Battle for D DC update. Yes. Uh, and then, looking ahead, there's some, some other things yeah. coming there's up. Yeah, there's a bunch of We've seen the Indigo before. We've seen... I mean, we can only see half of the picture with that screen, but <clears throat> yeah. yeah. The screen's perfect. Yes. Don't listen to him. But, and then, you know, specializations. Uh, yeah. All of that. Yeah. Um, what can you tell us about? Let, let's talk specifically about April fifth because there's um, there's some other things in that update that will be focused on. Um, I know Frederick Thailand has been talking about what he wants to do with yeah. some of the weapons. Yeah. So the first balance pass is going to be coming in yeah. on the fifth. Um, we'll have him out on next week. Actually, I won't be here, but uh, I've mm. convinced Ella to sit here and, and talk to yeah. Frederick. So it's going to be fun. Um, what other things are going to be a focus for the team in that update? I mean, I think there's first there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of bug fixing and a lot of things we are doing in there. A lot of things that the community has been reporting since the launch of the game uh, mm -hmm. that we couldn't necessarily deploy with the maintenance or with uh, the patch we will have tomorrow. Uh, so there's a there's a lot of things that are going to be fixed as part of that update. So hopefully, you know, there's like a lot of bugs that people have been experiencing and been frustrated with uh, that, should be, uh, that should be addressed. There's, as you mentioned, there's going to be some balancing uh, that is done. Uh, and I think it was, it was interesting for us to start with World Tier 4 and let people you know, like play mm -hmm. World Tier 4, start the min-maxing game in World Tier 4, experiment with some of the things, and now we you know, add World Tier 5. So that's the first opportunity for us to kind of like mm -hmm. uh, do a first pass and start fresh again with a new World Tier and, 
implement the gear set, so see how things are going to go with that, and uh, yeah, and then take it from there. Uh, so there's definitely uh, that path as well uh, that we're doing, and then there's a bunch of uh, yeah small things coming with it as well. Mm -hmm. What about with uh, I know. Hey, Fred is focusing on a lot of weapons and skill mods and wants to do some changes with weapon mods and that sort of thing. Mm. Um, you have talked to Redstorm a little bit about um, are they intending to do anything with PvP? Or? So PvP, we know that this is a big conversation in the community and yep. we are definitely reading all of that and the folks at Redstorm are really, uh, really interested in mm -hmm. everything and all the, you know, all the aspects and all the angles to, uh, to look at it. So, you know... We are definitely interested in that conversation, and yes, we are definitely going to be looking uh, at that. That's not a Tidal Basin thing. Uh, mm -hmm. So first, we want to finish, you know, and release Tidal Basin. I mean, it's finished by now, but <laughs> really yeah, yeah, sure. uh, But uh, we are not going to do uh, a big pass with that one. That's something for later. First, we, we do that one, and then we'll be looking at it. But yes, we are definitely interested in the conversation, imagine, so please keep it, uh, keep it going. I imagine it wouldn't really make sense uh, to balance basing on assumptions, especially with these gear sets coming in, right? Yeah. Like, I mean, I'm not, I'm not a game designer, but if, mm. you, if you balance based on where we're at right now, yeah. without taking into the context of how people actually leverage these gear sets, like you say, they're like crazy. Yeah, um, they're, uh, they're, they're real special. Yeah, yeah. And, and even with, again, with World Tier 5 and gear score going higher, mm -hmm. I mean, and, like, you know, stats also uh, yep. evolving and all of that. So we, we already have an understanding, you know, like project, projecting from where we are at with World Tier 4. There are mm -hmm. things we know are already outliers that we need to sure. address. Of course. Uh, but then we also don't want to be, you know, like uh, too drastic because we need to see how, how people are going to be playing around with all the yeah. new gear score items and the gear sets and all of that. Also, well, yeah, slow down. I'm only level 30. I've got to... I've got to hit max level before I get into that PvP game. Well, I don't have to. I know, I know you can play well, it Technically, it Technically, but... you're max level. You're level okay, no, but like, max gear score. Yeah, Nick, you know what I mean. Um, but, you, but you know what I mean. Like, I, that's yeah. when, I mean, I don't know about uh, you, but like, I... That's when I start PvP. Once I've mm -hmm. kind of played through everything and I've got some gear and I'll start... Yeah, I mean, usually you want to, I mean... Not everybody, but I think mm. the standard behavior would be that you you want to experiment mm. the campaign and reach the uh, reach the end game, and then you start engaging with all the different activities that are available and start exploring a bit more. Yes, agreed. Um, so I yeah, obsessively yeah. destroy bounties because they're my children and they have to die. <laughs> yeah. What about this guy? Oh, God, yeah. I, I was like, uh, can you can you please fix that? Who's I this? Would, I would love to fix that. I'm going to work on my new cosplay. It's going to be this guy. Actually, it's going to be that guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to show you it to do like E3. <laughs> weirder things to your elbows. <laughs> but it's kind of weird because it goes a bit in the back. It's like yeah, around yeah. behind the head. Yeah. Like this? They're all expert mimes except for this guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> love him. Um, we might have that fixed in. Uh, I don't know if it's fixed. In I really hope so. But I, I hope it not is. Checked. <laughs> I hope it's fixed. But I also hope like. Maybe it happens like one in a million times. You know what else is fixed actually in uh, oh. the title basin update? What's that? The weird stairs. The weird stairs? Oh, with the. Yeah, with the. The, oh, the, one, the, the, the one with the, the, the. There's been an article about the oh. strange stairs. Hi, Katagu. Hey, Katagu. So, <laughs> <how's it going? laughs> Hi. They wrote a. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes. Uh, yeah, thanks for writing that thing about what we said about animals. We should have a big philosophical discussion about it. That was fun. I would, I would genuinely have that, actually. That's um, should we start the debate again? I mean, no. it's not a debate, I'm right, so. I've got a big story for you, mm -hmm. and it's right here. Well, hello. <laughs> <laughs> Pointed to your boobies. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you did! <laughs>